Hello world, I'm Caroline Lancaster. And I'm Nico Lantome. A lot of people have been getting sick lately. Have you gotten sick, Caroline? Heck no, because my white blood cells are on my side. What about you? That's good. Um, no, I, they're not on my side. I, uh, I got the flu. Oh, well, speaking about the flu, my one and only brother, Will Lancaster, interviewed the nurses about the flu. Let's go check that out. Hey, Jose, did you hear what happened to Josh? No, what happened to him? He's dead, man. Uh, he's dead. Uh. Following the recent tragedy here at Norman High, I decided to go to the nurse to see what I could find out about this epidemic. Okay, my name is Courtney Williams. I'm the school nurse at Norman High School. And uh, how many people have come in uh, with the flu? Well, we really don't know. Unfortunately, we don't have flu swabs here. I wish that we did, um, but we don't. So all we can go by are people that report flu symptoms and temperature. Um, on average, I would say maybe two to three, um, except for last week we did see a peak one day where we sent about 10 kids home. So it is definitely picking up. It is high to the flu season, so that's pretty common. And uh, are there any ways to prevent getting the flu? There are ways to protect yourself against getting the flu. Um, of course, flu shot is number one. It's not 100%, but it does help give you some immunity and create some antibodies. It can also, if you get the flu, lessen the severity of it. Um, but my best advice to anybody out there is just good hygiene. So if you're around somebody that's coughing and they're not using a Kleenex to cover their cough, then make sure that maybe you kind of turn away from them so you're not catching that aerosol spray that's coming out. Um, another thing is um, making sure that you are cleaning up things using Clorox wipes, Lysol spray. It's a great option. Um, the number one thing, hand washing. Even if you don't have soap and water nearby, Use hand sanitizer, um, just a quick scrub. Make sure that you're not only rubbing the fronts of your hands, but the backs as well. And don't ever touch your face, whether you're eating, um, picking up your pencil, nervous habit of chewing your nails, just make sure during the season that you're not touching anything, not just your mouth. Nose, eyes, ears can all be portals for the flu virus as well. Wow, wasn't that informative? Now let's see what our local mortician, Dan Green, is up to to battle this epidemic. This is the good stuff. Let's get this show on the road. That's great to know. We won't get the flu now. I hope not. Let's go watch some basketball that Danny filmed now. Okay. We're going to mop the floor with North. Did they win? Who? Class Cron. <laughs> oh my God. That was very mysterious. I was not expecting that item to come up. Not at all. Let's go to check out Spencer's Star Wars package with baguettes. I love baguettes and I love Star Wars.
Sith Master was low. Your plans have been foiled now that I am here. The Force will guide me to defeat you. You know nothing. The dark side will be prevail. Jedi Master. Wow, I want a baguette now. That looked really good. I'm gonna watch Star Wars again. Yeah, let's take a break. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go to Panera and grab a, grab a baguette. And I'm gonna watch Kylo Ren. Sounds good. the norm. The norm. 
Welcome back to The Norm with your hosts, Nico and Caroline. So now we're going to show you a PSA of video games from the one and only Carson. I might be coming from a bit of a stereotypical standpoint here, but uh, don't let video games take over your life. Don't waste your life on video games. Take a break once in a while. You know, that makes me want to go play Halo 4 again. For I sure. love Halo. Let's go check out Josiah's PSA surprise. Another surprise? Wow, I'm surprised. You'll be even more surprised. Attention. If you or a loved one has been infected with the flu, you may be at risk for out of school. Here we see a boy with his coughing, laying down, trying to get some rest in the hallway. The flu is very contagious. Just a simple touch can infect others. But the good side to all of this is that you get to go home if you have the flu because it's very contagious and you can't be at school while you have the flu. This is a public service announcement. Another crazy surprise. I was blown away. They just don't stop. No, they really don't. Now it comes up to Jonathan's question of the week. And guess what it's about? What's it about? It's about the flu. The flu's just hitting everyone. Uh, no, I am not, thankfully. I've uh, stayed sterile. And, yeah. Is that, is that what you're going with here? Mm-hmm. No. I have not been effect affected by the flu personally. Um, I will so I will have her say I have made more of an effort to wash my hands, use hand sanitizer, um, wipe my nose less with my hands. Um, you know, just less germs in general, the better. Uh, I try to stay away from students, so I'd appreciate it if you guys would leave now. Yep, that sums up my year so far. Only like 99 days till you graduate. Yep, very excited. Well, that's all we have for the norm this week. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.